this video, we're going to show you how to pick an order using the handheld picking device. So first, what you want to do is you want to actually pull up the sales order. And then if you go into order details, you can see what items are actually on that order. And then from this screen, you could choose to change the status to ready to pick or release for picking. And alternatively, you could also choose to print the picking slip from this screen. However, uh, for this purpose, we're not going to actually do that from this screen. We're going to do it from the sales order review, but you can see that it's available here. Moving over to the sales order review screen, we're able to see that new order at the bottom there. So once again, we can see the items that are on it. We can see that its order status is new and we're going to take action. So what we're going to do is we're going to print the picking slip from here and we're going to set the status to ready to pick and this will notify people in the warehouse. So we can go ahead and actually take those actions. Now we're going to see the actual picking slip, which you can print off or you can choose to pull up on the actual handheld device itself. So there's a barcode that could be scanned or once again, it can be pulled up directly from the handheld device itself. You can now see that the status has been changed to pick uh, in the sales order review screen. Now looking at the actual handheld device, we can see that that exact same order is available. We didn't have to scan anything, we can just pick directly from here. And this pulls up that same pick list and now we can actually begin scanning items that are on the order. This is just a look into the details of those specific inventory items. So you can either scan items directly from the summary screen, or you can choose to scan and pick from the order details screen. It's gonna minimize the uh, inventory in the same way, but this screen just shows a little bit more detail. Now we're ready to go ahead and actually submit this order. Uh, so we can say yes, we want to confirm that we've picked all the items according to the pick slip. And now you can see that that order has disappeared and it's no longer available to be picked. When we log back into Blue Link and go into the warehouse shipping screen, we can pull up that same order from before. Going into order details again we can see the same inventory items and now they've all been highlighted in green because we've actually picked the correct amount from that sales order and from that pick slip. So now we can hit ship. Then it says shipment complete and that order is ready for further processing and, and to actually be sent out to the customer. Back in sales order review, we can see that the status has now been changed to shipped.